forward to seeing him in the future. Definitely. Ray, Ray Marlin Marlin again from, from the line. Marlon misses his first one from the line. Southfields, Terrence Rose, number 20, takes it down the court. Trying to show his team a little bit. Lieutenant, number 20 there. Marvelous pass over to Terrence Rose. Terrence Rose makes it for two off of the glass. Off of the letter of possession. Doug Miller bringing it up court for Southfield Lathrop right now. Trying to find an open man. Finally finds Tyrone Jenkins to Howard McElrath inside. Travel. He traveled. Bad move by Southfield Lathrop. This is the crucial time before the half. Southfield has 28 left plus 21. Southfield Lathrop is trying to decrease the score. Less than a minute left in this second period. Terrence Rose takes it up court. Looking for open man. And he finds Lionel Collins. Three point land. Earl Dorn, number 33, looks for someone. Earl Dorn takes it for a shot for two and misses it. Let, let Harris the with the rebound for Southfield Lathrop, number 11. Tyrone Jenkins brings it up. Passes to Howard McElrath. Walk again. That's the second time consecutively Southfield Lathrop has traveled, excuse me, walked here. Not only Southfield Lathrop, it's the second time consecutively Howard McElrath has walked. Chance Rose takes the ball up court. He's trying to waste a little time here. We have about 16 minutes before, 16 seconds, excuse me, before the half. Chance Rose wheels and deals. He finds Lionel Collins, number 23. Has back out to Chance Rose, number 20. Six seconds before the half. Southfield Lathrop steals the ball. Howard McElrath with the steal. Kermit Harris tries to bring it up court, but the time runs out in his second period. It's half time. Southfield's leading 28. Southfield Lathrop 21. This is half time. We have so many minutes before the half, and we will take a half time break. This is Randy McKelton and, and Craig Sukenik. He's signing off for this half. Craig, Southfield took off, and Southfield Lathrop took off right behind it, keeping right up with it. And I'm quite positive it'll be the same in this half, too. It's only a seven-point ball game right now, 21 to 28 in favor of the Southfield High Blue Jays. Here we go. Southfield Lathrop will have the first possession. Craig, I'll turn it over to you. Here we go. Here we go. Mark Chappelle is going to inbound it right now. Finds his man, Tyrone Jenkins, wide open. Kermit Harris. Now is the ball back to Jenkins, to Ray Moreland. Ray Moreland drives inside. Easy layup for Moreland. Very right, good. Count number 23 almost reached in there. Dan Franklin, number 13, passes off. Inbounds it to Rick Duncan. Passes back to Dan Franklin. Dan Franklin takes it down. Court to number 54 to one pick. It's one pick. pass for two, and he misses it. Rebound, Lionel Collins. Chris Greer gets the rebound. I mean, the messed up play by Lionel Collins and puts it up for two. Southfield 30, Southfield led to 23, third quarter. Doug Miller brings it up court, passes to Kermit Harris, to receive, gets it back from Kermit, gives it back to Kermit Harris. Kermit drives inside, layup inside, he misses. Looks like an over the back foul on number 32 for Southfield High. Yeah, that's Chris Greer, but it's not a shooting foul because teams aren't in foul trouble. Mark Chappelle passes it inside for Back to Mark Chappelle. Chappelle for three. Rick Duncan in fouls the ball to Dan Franklin. Rick Duncan gets the ball, ball again. Passes off to Chris Greer. Chris Greer passes off the line of Connor. Shoots for two. Misses it. Taiwan picks it up with a rebound and he tries for two but did not make it. He will shoot for two, the ref says. Fouled by number 11, Kermit Harris. That's his, his first foul. And the team's first for this half. That's his second, the team's first. Tawan Pickett is very good from the free throw line, but he needs to concentrate just a little bit more. Let's see what he can do. Dribbles a little bit, looks at the basket, and he nails it. That's Not his first point for the half. Nothing but net on that shot. Oh, yeah. Top for now, 31. South for later, 26. Tawan Pickett, 6'5", junior. Tries for a second one and he nails that one also. Excellent. South Philadelphia now's possession. Ray Marlin inbounds it to Doug Miller, the sophomore. 
Miller brings it up court very slowly. They want to convert on this drive. Passes to Ray Morlin. Morlin looking for an open man, can't find one. Finally does to Mark Chappelle. Chappelle steps out of bounds. Even if Southfield Lathrop got that ball, Southfield would have picked it up because I know Collins was in the air. He was all over that one. Chris Greer inbounds ball to Rick Duncan. Rick Duncan is known around here at WSJ as Colonel Rick Duncan. He's a senior. He passes off to Juan Pickett. Juan Pickett back to Rick Duncan. Rick Duncan tries for two and he misses it. Juan Pickett puts it back up. He makes it for two. A little bit of confusion underneath the rim, but it's all right. Southfield came up with the points. Southfield 34, Southfield led to 26. Doug Miller bringing it up court for the Chargers right now. Passes inside. Oh, Ray Morton a little careless there. Moreland gets the ball swatted away and then hits it out of bounds. Southfield High School's ball. He was looking for a foul. Now oh. he gets a foul. Rep changes his mind at the little conference. Head ref says Southfield Lakers possession. And number 21 of Lakers, Campbell. Mark Chappelle will take it out. Let's see. Southfield trying to improve on his defense here. Doug Miller with the ball around the three-point range. Being checked by Rick Duncan, number three of Southfield. Miller finds his man, Kermit Harris. Harris looking inside, finds Doug Miller. Back out to Tyrone Jenkins. Jenkins, long gone and goes. Chris Greer inbounds it to Rick Duncan. Rick Duncan passes way down court to Dan Franklin. Dan Franklin cross court to Lionel Collins. Lionel Collins for two and he off the iron. Lionel Collins comes off with a steal. Passes out to Rick Duncan, number three. Rick Duncan passes off to Tawan Pickett, number 54. Tawan Pickett to Chris Greer. Chris Greer tries off the iron. Rick Duncan comes up with the rebound again. Good hustle by Rick Duncan. Too many put ups for, for Southfield and two. Less, not too many uh, naked shots that go in the basket there. Three dunk pass off to Chris Greer. Chris Greer spins and turns and puts it up for two, and he nails it. Good inside move by Chris Greer that time. Mark Chappelle now with the ball for Latham. Brings it up court slowly. They've got to convert on this drive right here. Find his man, Kermit Harris, number 11, the sophomore. Being checked extremely well by Dan Franklin. Harris puts it back out to Mark Chappelle. Now gives it to Doug, Doug Miller, and Miller can't make it. There's a foul. Jason Whitlow gets the rebound, on, then gets fouled. There's a foul, and it's on Chris Greer. This is Whitlow's first trip to the line today. Whitlow will shoot for two. I'm fire positive. Let's see if he's good from the free throw line. Whitlow so far has been held scoreless this game. Southfield has 36, Southfield later has 28. Jason Whitlow is a junior. Six foot one. That's pretty tall for a junior. Tries for his first shot and he rolls around and around, but it did not go in. He tried for his second one. A little bit more concentration to get the ball and the goal. Nothing but net on his second shot. That's concentration. With Whitlow's first basket of the Kyle day. Passes it to number 20. Chris Greer receives the ball. A little mass confusion. Chris Greer turns up with the ball. Crazy dribbling by Chris Greer. Chris Greer back out to Terrence Rose, number 20. Terrence Rose cannot make up his mind. Passes it to Lionel Collins, number 30. Number 23, Lionel Collins to Rick Duncan. Rick Duncan, look like he about to for free throw land. Terrence Rose getting a little disgusted with the scene there. Passes out to Chris Greer. Chris Greer to Lionel Collins. Lionel Collins tries to put it up. Stripped away by Doug Miller, the sophomore. Lathan. Now Lathan Fall. There's a conversion. Earl Dorn, number 33, takes the place of Lionel Collins, number 23. Doug Miller brings it up court for Lathan. Like, both teams are getting a little tired, if you notice. Mark Chappelle with the long gun, and it goes. That's Chappelle's sixth point of the day. Rick Duncan passes away across court to Terrence Rose, number 20. Terrence Rose to Kawan Pinkett. Kawan Pinkett for two, and he nails it from the baseline. Lathrop's got to tighten up on D right now. Miller brings it up court for the Southfield Lathrop Chargers. And the score is Southfield 38, Southfield Lathrop 32. 
Kermit Harris gets it knocked away, and it's still Southfield Lathrop's ball. Southfield has a lot of potential. Southfield and Southfield Lathrop has a lot of potential on the bench. Yeah, Junior Mark Carroll on the bench, and from Southfield, yeah, Bugley still on the bench. Tall guy, six seven. Both of them juniors. Bugley is the center though. Kermit Harris brings it around and shoots and misses for Southfield Lathrop. Southfield High's ball now. Rick Duncan brings it up court. Rick Duncan slowing the pace down a little bit. We had three minutes, 18 seconds before for the fourth period. Chris Greer receives the ball from Rick Duncan. Oh, careless dribbling burst. Could be a fast break for Doug Miller, the sophomore. Foul. Rick Duncan jumped up a little bit too late and just smashed him almost to the ground. Chris Greer, careless mistake. Coach Vanderbrink is taking him out, replacing him with Marvin Reynolds. Bad mistake by Chris Greer. Careless dribbling. He must be tired, Craig. Definitely. South of Lathrop has stayed basically with the same people all ball game. It's an excellent lineup, though. Excellent lineup. South of Lathrop has possession. Ray Morland from three point and he nails it. Dutch Moreland's 10th point in the ballgame. Now takes over as Lathrop's leading scorer. He picks up a foul, too. He's excellent for the free throw line. This might bring Southfield's lead into one. Southfield takes a, I think this is a minute timeout. Southfield Lathrop's really turning it on. They sure. How's the score? Now the score is 35 to 38. Southfield Lathrop needs to keep up the pace they're setting right now. It's 35 to 38. With Ray Moreland on the line right now. Moreland has been nearly perfect from the line. He's six, five for six today. Excellent, excellent. They need that. That might just win them the game. Moreland makes it again. This is the 11th point of the ball game. Now 37, 30. Sears Rose inbounds it to Rick Duncan. Rick Duncan takes it down court. Rick Duncan slowing the pace down a little bit. Rick Duncan passes out to Marvin Reynolds, number 24. Marvin Reynolds looking for a man, finds Earl Dorn, number 33. Earl Dorn wheels and deals up the middle. Shoots it for two. Southfield has 40. Southfield left the pass 36. Number 13, Doug Miller, the sophomore, bringing it up court, using his speed to get by his man. Miller trying to find a man open. He's being Finds checked. Ray Moreland. He's being checked by Rick Duncan. Moreland long gun and it goes. Moreland's 13th point of the ball game. Excellent. Moreland's hot. Green Southfield leads to two. Southfield has 40. Southfield late to 36. Terrence Rose takes it down court. Pass up to Juan Pickett. To Juan Pickett pass to Earl Dorn. Earl Dorn looks. He tries. No, he pass up Terrence Rose. Terrence Rose to three point land. He nails it. Colin McElrath inbounds it to Ray Moeller gets it knocked away. Now brings it back up court. Stops his dribble, has to find a man open. Finds Doug Miller, the sophomore. Good move inside by Miller. Scores. That's his 10th point in the ball game. That was for two. Terrence Rose, number 20, takes it down on court. He's looking for a man. He's looking for a man. He finds Rick Duncan. Rick Duncan slows the face down a little bit. Rick Duncan passes it off to Terrence Rose. Terrence Rose from behind the backboard misses it. It's in Marvin Reynolds' hands. Marvin Reynolds just so happened to give the ball to Earl Dorn. Earl Dorn slows the game down, passes off to Terrence Rose, number 20. Terrence Rose, number 20, slows the game down a little bit. Passes off to Marvin Reynolds, number 24. Number 24, Marvin Reynolds takes up the hole, tries for the shot, but did not succeed off the bottom of the rim. Southfield late, they're really starting to get aggressive on defense now. Southfield's Mount Reynolds caused the foul there. He shoot for two. Coach Vanderbrink is so for a second. I guess he wants him to calm down. Take a little bit of anger out. Remember, stress from crosstown rivals, Craig. Lathrop is determined not to get into foul trouble. It's not. It's a non-shooting foul. Terrence throws inbounds to Rick Duncan. Rick Duncan pass to Earl Dorn. Earl Dorn from behind the backboard. No way. Marvin Reynolds shoots for two. No way. Taiwan Pickett gets the ball. And foul on number 33, Tyron Jenkins, his second. Team, teams are now tied in fouls. Southfield has three team fouls. Southfield Lathrop has three team fouls. Southfield. Southfield has 
has 43 points. South Philadelphia has 40 points. South Philadelphia could tie this game up with a three.